much to commentate from this venue. A warm welcome to North London. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It is Tottenham Hotspur, and they face Luton Town. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Hyung Min Son plays with Dejan Kulusevski out wide. And the striker is Richarlison. A room to roam on the wing. Who can he pick out? Nakamba. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, there we have it, the first yellow card of the game. And he's going to have to be careful now. There's a long time to go here. Long way out, this, And never in any doubt from the keeper. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Nicely saved. Whipped in by Barkley. And a struggle to get it away properly. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. James Madison. Hoybier. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Richard Son. Son! Wonderful block. Well, let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved. They've played really well so far. One nil then. Marvelous Nakamba. And moving the ball nicely. Marvellous Nakamba. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. And the counter looks on here. Options available. And possibilities inside the box. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. That's very effective, good high pressing. And room now out on the wing. Well, nothing comes of it, it looked promising. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Asking a lot to score from there. Goalkeeper's ball. Eric Dyer. It's with Porro. Richarlison. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come.
Elijah Adebayo. Barkley with it. Good movement. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Richarlison under pressure doesn't seem to be bothering him well taken away he won the ball marvellous Nakamba Well, as you can see, Spurs have completely controlled the possession, but in terms of creating chances, they've been well below their normal standards. Unless that changes quickly, it's going to be a really frustrating day for them. Now Son. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Elijah Adebayo. Nakamba, and in with a real chance. Well, he was on his own. He had the goalkeeper to beat, but failed to do so. Well, he just needed to show a bit more composure there. Take a little bit off the shot, I think. Davis and Hoybier with it James Madison on the ball Richarlison back with Son Hoybier no, couldn't quite find his teammate A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at... So here we go, into the second half. At the home of Tottenham Hotspur. in the center Richarlison Hoybier return to Richarlison interception to snuff out the danger the supporters want to see him have a go Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? 
the keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Underway again, and Tottenham with the advantage. Marvellous Nakamba. Lokonga. Barkley with it. It's with Nakamba. Adebayo. And they find a gap in the defence. Barkley. It's with Nakamba. Carlton Morris and players waiting in the centre Barkley Nakamba now with Barkley can they square the game? well he was under a bit of pressure but he'll feel he should have done a bit better with the header Well, as the stats show us, Spurs haven't enjoyed that much of the ball. But that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. A chance to whip it in. Accurate ball and draws the near post. But keeper's ball. They'll be disappointed with that delivery. Oh, tremendous vision. Marvellous Nakamba. Untidy on the ball. Richarlison. Son. Good tackle, take it away. And Perisic takes it forward. He has teammates he can play it to. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Almost found its target, but cutting it out in the end. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. 50-50 this one. He twisted his knee. He's been trying out, but... Jeff... Spurs get the advantage from the referee. Did well to win the ball back. Barkley. Elijah Adebayo. Well, it's one pass after another. Carlton Morris. How about the cross? Could be. The save was a good one. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? Well, the referee remaining very much in control. Now the card, and it's yellow. Well, a struggle to get it away properly. Not getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Burke. Carlton Morris well, doesn't have to do it on his own and that wasn't a million miles away almost the equaliser well it's not a bad effort is it but they've got to find a way back into this one time for a change then Romero Pedro Porro and on to Kurusevsky Well, these Tottenham fans are making so much noise in here. The atmosphere is incredible. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Madison. 
on to Son. Offside by a fraction. Barkley. Elijah Adebayo. Well, still time for them to level it. Chance to cross. Great block. Had a play for a Spurs throw in. Bentancourt. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe in terms of the scoreline as far as the visitors are concerned here. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.